Bo mentioned to me, he's like, Paul, you ever been to Muscle Shoals? And I'm just like, dude, I'm crazy about it. You know, I've never been up there though. <clears throat> he says, well, I feel like we need to cut the guts of the album there. At this point, I am like, holy moly. Like, did I just get asked to go record it? Fame Studios in Muscle Shoals, Alabama, where Etta James and Aretha Franklin and Wilson Pickett and <laughs> the best have recorded. And I was just like getting a candy store. My grandfather um, was a song leader in the Church of Christ. And he taught me how to sing when I was little. Gave me an ear. Um, he was just a uh, upstanding man and a very uh, eccentric, outgoing performer. And I mean, even some people criticized him in the Church of Christ for being too, too Elvisy and going around the church and singing. You know, he just. I mean, to sing my ass off, I guess. And hold his last uh, signature off his will right there on my arm. So, I want to play guitar. I always think of him, but you know, he's my dude. Sure. I'm preparing to lose my mind while I'm trying to make you Writing songs is kind of like putting together a puzzle and sometimes you need certain puzzle pieces in order to finish your song and so I will wake up early in the mornings and I write all my ideas and I'll write my melodies and I'll get my, my phone out and do voice memos so yeah I start whittling away and I either sometimes I'll come with a cool first line I'll come with a chorus or you know I have the whole song. Sometimes I finish a song in 10 minutes and it's just like, hell yeah, Grand Central on the album. Finish that in 10 minutes. <laughs> Biggest influence, I'd have to say, would be Elvis, Roy Orbison, and Hemingway is pretty cool. FDR and General Patton. <laughs> Those are my influences. <laughs> Be my spirit and my guide here. Yeah. Don't leave me hanging out all night. It's been a pleasure to be able to just sing, you know. And my cousins can't, some of them can't even sing a note to save their life come from the same cloth. I'm just lucky when you Jesus was the first rock star. Like he ran around and he was known. You know what I mean? And I I read and I take the good things out of religious books and I try to take them into positive energy and help others and do unto others as I'd want my, them to do unto me. And I try to shine as much light as I can. And I believe that positivity and peace and happiness is all God. <laughs>